This is your Royal Fidelity Business News. I'm Jiminita Swain. Tourism officials reporting it's back to business as usual in the country for hotels, resorts, dive operations and tours following the passage of last week's Hurricane Matthew. Following the all clear issued by the National Emergency Management Agency last Friday, the majority of businesses in the tourism industry resumed operations and the Ministry of Tourism is sending the message out to the world that the many islands in the Bahamas are open for business. Tourism representatives throughout the Bahamas conducted assessments of the tourism product immediately following the storm's passage. In other business news, Research and Markets announced the addition of the future of the Bahamas oil markets, investments, projects and companies to 2025 exploration report today. Business Wire says the report identifies key trends and drivers of the Bahamas oil markets and provides the company's SWOT profile. The research work identifies the key moves taken by government, companies and investors to cop up the global changes and minimize the risk in current market conditions. And in international business news, Samsung Electronics is reporting today that it's sending fire-resistant packages to the United States-based customers as a precaution against possible fires or explosions from the Galaxy Note 7 as they return to retailers. Samsung is offering pre prepaid shipping boxes as an option for U.S. consumers who purchase the phones on its website, samsung.com. It said consumers who purchase their Note 7 phones from mobile carriers should visit the carrier's website for recall instructions. That was your Royal Fidelity Business News. I'm Jiminita Swain.